Hello, in this video I will show you how can you easily import thousands of uh, product images uh, to your Shopify store. So I have here uh, my products, I already imported my products but they don't have any images. So my goal is to upload my images easily but uh, let's assume there's thousands of images and I don't want to spend time manually uploading them because it's super time consuming. Uh, and uh, it's also super boring uh, so i don't want to spend time with this uh, so we built an app uh, which is a smart bulk image uh, upload app uh, which is uh, automating this it works with google drive and dropbox and basically it's fetching images from there it's matching it uh, with your products and it will upload these uh, images automatically to your products so here I have my Google Drive folder. In this example, I will be demonstrating you how to do it with uh, Google Drive, but you can do exactly the same things with uh, Dropbox as well. So here you can see there is a product images uh, and uh, these product images should match with these products. Uh, basically, it will match based on SKU. And uh, then let's, let's see how it works. So here, so let's click on open. Okay, now we are inside our app and here you can see I previously run some jobs uh, so you can ignore this. What we need to do is to create a new upload and first of all we need to connect our Google Drive account. So I click on connect, I select my account, I say continue. I need to give permission, this step is important uh, to be able to access all the images say continue and now our account is connected uh, uh, we are uh, you see it's fetching uh, folder names from Google Drive and now I will search folders that my images in that which I already demonstrated and uh, I have uh, several matching options so matching by SKU, match if image contains SKU, match if SKU contains image and same uh, for barcode, uh, EN code. Uh, so in my example, I will just match them by exact SKU. And uh, there's also option to replace existing images. So let's say you want to import images from scratch. You already imported some images, but uh, you just want to uh, include new images and uh, you can use uh, replace existing images option or just if you don't have any images at all. So you can use don't replace existing images. That's faster and easier option and then you can say start matching it will not upload immediately it first will match these images and show you how they are matching uh, so you will see the preview here in my screen you can see that i have a product which is called backpack blue which has sku as a blue dash backpack and then my image also blue backpack you can see that it's matched because of uh, these parts. So basically it's matched because it has this and this underscore one is detected as a position of the image. So basically there is like uh, this image is going to be second image for this product and this image is going to be third image for the same product. We can also click and see which product is that and which variant is that as well because this product actually has variants so it's like blue variant here you can see and then SQ of this product is here so basically this product will be uploaded for this variant and then uh, if we see all the results here satisfying uh, everything matches correctly we can start upload but before this I can also show you Another option as well, because here you can see only 17 images uh, matched. But in some cases, our SQUs may not be exactly matching, but uh, our image name can be a bit longer or our SQ can be a bit longer, but they contain each other. So uh, let's show an example here. So I'm creating a new upload, again, selecting my demo folder. 
again I am selecting if image contains SQ so image name is longer and inside it uh, somewhere it has uh, SQ in it so you can see like uh, shoes B so it's not exactly but it contains SQ so it's matched uh, again so that's uh, kind of examples are like shoes CR and because it's here it's matched as well so that's also case by case you may have this kind of cases and you can see like more images matched in this way when I'm doing this uh, more images matched so based on your situation you can also reach out to support and we will help you to figure out the right option for you if needed we can also help you with some customizations uh, and uh, yeah basically make it work for you and here you can also see non-matched images as well so if you click normally on the link here view details you should see why this uh, image is not matched so basically for this image uh, expected SQ was this but because there's no any product or variant with this SQ uh, it hasn't been matched uh, and you can see more examples like this basically it will give you all the information what's matching what's not and then if everything is good uh, then you can use uh, start upload button to basically start the upload job so let's start it uh, here you can see that uh, it will be showing us the upload progress everything will be shown here so you can see every detail so this image uploaded to this variant you can already click on it and it will take you to the variant you can see okay this is assigned correctly uh, and you can basically see the progress here but you don't have to wait here it can be thousands of images it can take some time so you can just close this screen and come back to this later or you can in parallel start another job which uh, will be running for your another folder so here you can also see the we are showing progress here so you can just follow it and we are in the end of this job we are sending email so make sure you are clicking on settings and you are changing uh, to write email address so we can send you an email when job is finished and here as i mentioned you can change also source to dropbox uh, but yeah like uh, based on your situation you can decide whatever uh, source is more available for you and what's more suitable for your situation for your business process uh, here you can also stop the job anytime if you see something is going wrong or oh, no wrong products are being assigned you can stop this uh, anytime if you see yeah in the beginning something is wrong so now job is finished if I go to my product list now I will refresh my page and uh, we see yes uh, some product images are assigned and now for example for this product I have uh, a lot of images here uh, and all this came automatically from our job uh, from our app so yeah I hope this helped you to automate your process already a lot of uh, uh, fashion brands furniture brands and uh, different uh, type of uh, uh, brands are using this product to upload uh, their product images uh, and uh, they are super happy and we we are uh, also trying to help uh, our customers uh, to set up everything correctly don't hesitate to contact uh, our support me or my co-founder will help you and uh, yeah i hope you are having a nice day and uh, good luck